Hey guys, Arthur Gamers here with another video, and today we are playing Space Food Truck Episode, whatever the fuck this episode number is. How are you guys doing today? That is still a stupid question, and we just got a Vexil. What are we going to have to do right now? We have to find the Chocolium Powder at the one planet it could possibly be at. Which we have no clue where it is. Yay. What we're going to have to do now is we're going to have to go look around and ask around in a bunch of places and see if we have the luck to find the chocolium powder. Accident prone, skunked, and serpentity. Not much I could really use and not much I could really do in this turn so let's end it. What we have to do is we have to go ask around and fly around to random places to see if we can somewhere find that chocolate and powder because otherwise we wouldn't be able to make the last re recipe that we still need to make. Uh, let's see what we can do with the cookstone right now. Mm, we also need to get the yellow X from the engineer to the cook which we can do by a certain card the cook has, if I do remember correctly. Which is going to be the free sample card, which I don't have right now, so it's not very useful. Shield is full, don't need the Aegis battery. Uh, we could use the X-ray Bronalyzer to Bronalyze one leftovers here. Would have been nice if it was a Vexor, but still, use the Flux Inverter to get worth out of that, and next phase. Well, well, there's not really a reason why I would not want to buy a poster of cheese, but today I'm going for a pop pass, so everyone has at least two of them for emergency situations. Nice. Okay, so now the scientist's turn. What are we going to do here? We're going to continue. Oh, the draw pod is busted. Really? Really? We're going to see whatever we can do to, like, make our journey quicker. There's nothing we have in job cards, but we can mold this card to any unique structure of any non-job card in any other player's hand. Which might be interesting, because we might be able to get a power glove, for instance. To get more cards, which we can actually research something with. Let's do that as well. Oops, try to add a space skill here, which doesn't have any power charge. That's a bad thing. Okay. So, what are we going to have to do, because we have all of these, except for that one? What we're going to have to do is we're going to have to find ways to travel more quicker and ask around more. Which means I'll basically get that one for now. And don't think there's much else we can do. Backtrack is not too useful, but it still is a thing. So it's fine. Leftovers, no choice. We have to move on to see if we can get some items that aren't leftovers. Now, sorry if I'm sounding weird, I'm having hiccups, great. Of course we're hit by an asteroid. At least it's at me, like, turn I can actually <laughs> help anything. Oh, we got a Vex with Exterminator as well. X-ray Burnalyzer. Oh, that contains, if we destroy that one, we won't be able to finish the game. That's literally a thing. You will not be able to ever finish the game if you destroy that one. Okay, could have probably used that better, but sure. We can, right now, fix the lap door and two shields. Don't really have too much interest in just, like fixing the draw pocket. And uh, let's destroy two uh, vexels. Not this one, sadly, but sure. Next turn. Uh, probably gonna have to give you some leftovers. Sorry. Next turn will be the captain. And now we have to engage. Please don't hit us with something bad. We have to avoid... Fuck, it's life support. Of course it is. We're gonna be stuck with that till we repair it. Crikey. Okay, I guess I'll just go for one single jump. Maybe if we're extremely lucky, we'll get the chocolate and powder right now. Like, I mean, that would be the luck. That would be so amazing. I wouldn't even be able to imagine that happening. No, this is a solar crab location actually. We could probably use that for worth and value as well. Change it's wrong. Play this card and 
Play to discard this and the rest of your hand and draw replacements for each discard. That's an interesting card. It's quite expensive though. There's two of them even. And then we have a Claw of Duty, which is nice. The Raw Silk, Solar Crab, and the Space Kill. Well, not really any uh, reason to leave any of these behind because, well, there is no reason to leave any of them behind. Because, well, there is no reason to not fill all the slots actually. It could be useful for something maybe later. Maybe, maybe not. But yeah, I just repeated the same thing three times and it still made sense. Yay. Cook's turn, let's see what we can do. Oh no, Christ, it's Mr. Jingles. The scientist may have gone too far uh, augmentating the intelligence of his favorite lab red, Mr. Jingles. Having escaped his cage, the rodent is leaving a trail of threatening messages and defiant little poops. The chef and captain have two turns to reach the lab and recapture the red, or the ship takes one damage. Of course it does, that makes no sense. Aegis battery, that recharges the shield by one, always nice to do. Flam is always nice to destroy shit from someone's hand. There might be a Vexor or some leftovers or a roll, anything really that does not belong here. I'm really gonna get rid of one of your leftovers here. That's really best choice. And whole pass. We do need to go to the lab. Yeah, let's do that right now. I'm sorry, by the way, if you hear the noises outside. There is people like playing with a scooter or a scootmobile outside, and it's kind of bugging me. Not really much I can do with that. Uh, cloth duty. Play to pull any card, including job cards from the discard, into your hand. That can always be used for us, the chef, as well. And turn, and let's see what we can do with the scientist. Probably gonna research some shit. Oh god, we're stuck with Xana's invasion again. <laughs> Great, those always happen at the times you don't want them to happen. Let's do some research here as we cannot escape with this one. Anyway, there's no way we can do research because we'd need two points for that. We have two points, I mean we'd need three points for the minimum of that, so no, that's not gonna happen. Next phase, we can buy some solar crap. That's some nice, nice worth and some nice power to use for the engineer wait that's the scientist for the engineer for the scientist and i'm now going to the engineer's turn i have not doing too great at speaking properly crikey not really need to upgrade my ship but we could probably use a trusty wrench to like do some shit because we have stuff to fix. Shields, life support is important, lab door, and draw pot. We could fix everything. That's nice. That's nice for a change. And then probably gonna add some more leftovers, sadly. You are really stuck with a large amount of those. Crikey. I guess that's fine. It's not horrible. Oh god, really? Hmm. Speed. Pours sweat sweet pour a sweet pours down someone's face. Uh, I have to discard four power to, or take three damage. Well we have four shields and I do need the whole mass to resolve a crisis, but that crisis takes less damage than this does. But the power glove may give us some more cards as well to do more shit with, so sorry I'm gonna damage here. Probably a bad decision, but still. Let's use that whole pass even though that takes away some worth. And resolve that crisis so we don't get even more damage. And then use the power glove to get more cards to engage to fly further. Two spots, actually. That's nice. Now we're getting somewhere. Just going to random planets now to see if we can find whatever we need to find. Yay. That looks like Earth with round islands on it. Oh no, the monster is back! Of course it is, not really a need to do spending on that. Let's punch it further. And see what we find here on X Vega. Skunk! To the FDR drive smells funny, discard one power to run a filtration cycle or we have to dump the rest of a charge. Well, there is no rest of a charge, so that doesn't make sense to spend anything on. Dock the ship and see what we can find here. Well, the Aegis battery is always nice, and the Unimo, Un Unomas, I keep saying that wrong. You know, <laughs> the Unomas remote is always nice as well, and the Redefined Silk will also add some more stuff we could use. 
We do have to deal with that monster now, though. Next phase. Oh, uh, yeah, we could probably use the refined silk with the captain. Pretty well. Pretty darn well, actually. Let's continue on back to the cook and see if we can maybe get the shit we need. Short circuit. I don't think a shield is supposed to spark up. Four power to reboot. That's all our power we have. That is the diploma bot. I wanted to use that to solve a crisis, but a crisis is still better than all shields gone. Taste test. Can we play that? No, we need to go back to our kitchen and we can because the monster is in the hole. That... That absolutely sucks. That absolutely sucks and because of the discarding earlier, we are stuck without any money to buy any cards we need. Great. Crisis, it's alive. Oh, wait, it's the offensive souffle again. Okay. <laughs> Let's not spend any more time discussing how, why that is funny. Yeah, it's an offensive souffle. It's funny, okay? Okay, nothing we can do. Next phase. Nothing we can really buy. Let's add some worth to our pod with the still a fat space kale. Yay! And continue on to see whatever the engineer will get now. Probably some shit to repair. As you can see, asteroids are common enough. Failed. Crisis ominous blinking. Yeah, sorry. Um, you, you may have just damaged the ship with one point. Can't really use the whole pass right now. Trusty wrench or duct tape. Well, there is not really any use to spend the duct tape, I don't think. So let's first use trusty wrench to see... Wench. Just a wrench to see what we can fix. And we already way over covered that, so next phase will be nice. Ne next phase, please. Oh, the charge is still. The yeah, shoot is still be charging. That's nice. Okay, you know, Master Remote will be nice for you, considering you don't have money for the $7 or $8 shit. Right now. Let's see if we can go somewhere with the captain again. And of course, we get hit by an asteroid. Cloth duty, put to play any card, including job cards, we discard pile. Well, there's probably something in power we could get out of here. For instance, this lovely refined silk. That's nice to have. Let's engage this. And... Use the refined silk and the whole pass to go shit. And then two silk left to, like, dodge events or something. Let's go around this way or something. Yeah, that'll be nice, and then we have one FTL charge left next time, so we don't have to refill or engage card at all. Spanx. Of course it's Spanx. More solar crabs, punch it. It's not gonna stay here for solar crabs, no. Space time flies. For lack of better explanation, space time seems to have just hiccuped. Reduce all for crisis timers by four. Yeah, sure, punch it. Not interesting right now, at least. Batangi, we have Pap Talk. The captain would like a ward. Another random player feels invigorated and draws a card. Yeah. Good! The engineer drew a card that we could probably use. No! I said dock it instead of punch it. I feel stupid now. Yes, I do. Gamatose isn't really interesting. The claw could be something. Raw silk claw you know, universal remote. We need cheap items now because you don't always get enough money to do shit. And that's not enough power to charge that, so that's the turn, sadly. Probably gonna give you some more powering raw silk right now. He could probably use that. He could probably give the claw as well. That would have added some more worth to the hand still, instead of just the Degrading to zero. Of course, Xanus is after us again. Xanus the Conqueror, how many planets have you attacked now? Even attacked twice at the same time? Don't really have an explanation for that. And we've been caught in the crossfire. It's almost insane. Let's use the extra runlighter to destroy this leftovers, which is really nice. And let's use the claw to... Not really much need. Wait, if we use a 
flambe. That's a job card. Oh, we cannot get the job cards. Maybe the diploma bot is nice, depending on the playing field. Oh, I'll get the diploma bot. It's nice anyway. Yeah, there is actually something we need to resolve, so I'm glad I did that. I could not really any need to do that one. I'll do this one. I'll be gone for saying to the Conqueror, I'm pretty sure. Let's see the hand. Yeah, it'll probably be gone then. So, Flux Inverter, Hall Pass, let's move back to our own room. And end up this turn with a massive amount of money. The exchange at one will probably be what we're gonna buy here. As we have the money for it, and that's nice. Extremely nice. And we will head into the scientist turn now. Of course it's a Vexel, of course it is. Did, wait, did you just see his head go red? That was unhealthy looking to say the least. Oh crikey. Nothing we can do, next phase. Probably gonna give you Unimus remote as well. It's basically like a base card, but better because it can also do something if you really needed to do something. Oh, the engineer's turn looks bad. That's a bad hand. Crisis, a mysterious message. We've received an urgent message in a foreign language that only your scientist and chef can translate. Okay, 12 turns for 1 damage, of course. Power Glove! Get us something we need. Oh, we got an achievement! More Power Gloves! And still nothing. And that doesn't help because there's nothing in the discard pile. We just have a whole hand of nothing. We have a whole hand that's worth like an insane amount of power. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And it's worth nothing. It's like basically worth nothing. It's worth 5. Look at the amount of cards and the amount of worth. That's, that's, um... <laughs> some luck, I, I'd say. Yeah. Next turn and... Let's see if we can drive away from here with Captain and see if we can actually reach something interesting this episode, because so far it's been absolutely boring. We've done absolutely nothing. Of course, we get Space Drink now. Yeah. Okay, Overdrive. Oh, that's actually really nice. We'll be going shit. That, that would be a stupid choice, but it would be so stupid if the ingredient we needed is right there. Then we'd miss it in that way. That would be kind of silly as well. Let's use that route and see if we can find shit we need on that routing. Macaronis, of course. Everyone danced to macaronis. <laughs> Mark one off. You chat with a fellow captain. Oh, the breaky bounce. Oh, we're gonna get a, we're gonna get a breaky bounce, of course. Uh, we're gonna get a breaky bounce. Oh, great. That's right. In the next step, we were going to Plutano. The breaky bounds will be real. Yes, it would. Two! That's not actually too bad. I'll take the damage for that. We could be facing much worse later, like Space Pirates, which will basically take your cards if you don't pay them enough. A sure thing! Zapmart item. Tail leave. Oh, didn't really need that. Sorry. Punch it. We really just need a shock clean powder. Tinnitus, hello, that's a pink planet. Technically stealing, your engineer swipes some power from a busted old satellite shield to fill by plus two. Punch it once again and see where we arrive. Please say this is not space pirates because I think you need to pay four power for that. Not a sure thing, please. Solar crab, of course. Not anything we needed. Okay, you know there's a mode, apply my bots, spun silk, spun silk, don't want the gamma ray, I don't really like the gamma toaster. Next phase, leftovers of course, because you have these stupid facts on, already have items of no worth. Crikey. So what's actually busted? The door is busted on a draw pod. Not a draw pod busted, crikey. We could probably use a taste test right now. To see if we can get an item we could actually use. Flambe is pretty decent. Hall pass we don't need. Don't destroy that though. Uh, we don't. We can't really cook anything either. So the only thing left is a flambe, which could destroy an item from someone's hand. Any vexels here? No. To the future. Oh, there's leftovers. Good. Good. I want to destroy some leftovers or, or worse actually, but leftovers is fine as well. Fine and dandy. Let's play that Gamma Toaster with that one, so it destroys the leftovers afterwards. That's quite useful, Steel, because it destroys the leftovers after this turn. 
No, I like you some universe remote. That's actually quite good for you as well. And you are now gone. Thank you. Just read some leftovers by an item I actually really hate and it's not that useful in general. Doors busted. Of course the door is busted. Everything is going to be busted. Hmm. I don't think we have enough to really give anyone anything. Oh wait, we have three. We can give you something. Secret sauce. We already have. We have unlocked nodes, fast track. Let's do that one. Another Mimi Cube. That that's that's okay. Let's see what you can do. Mimi Cube. We make some. <laughs> That'd be silly if we choose a yellow X. Actually, that wouldn't be too silly, would it? Can 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 I can I see the? No. Can can I see your hand? Okay, let's try this again. Wait, for fuck's sake! We have research, meaning if we get four power in here, we could research something. Let's see if we have any items that could provide us with four power. Yes, we do. Of course we do. That's good. That means another research node can be unlocked, probably for the captain, if you really needed, or the chef, because we still need more free samples if we could. But that wasn't a free sample, but still, that was quite useful. Spun silk and, and the turn. We're getting somewhere, slowly but surely. And that was a Vexel. Lovely. Engineer's turn! Oh no! I needed a free sample in the neck in the last turn for the cook, but we didn't have it. <laughs> Great. I don't want to spam I may want to actually spend power on this. Dodge that and then use the duct tape to Break the life support, well, actually repair the broken life support and go to the next phase. I'll do one more round of turns this episode and then that's gonna be pretty much it, I think. Because it's getting quite long already, if I look at the time. It's not too bad yet, but I did a lot of turns this episode, though. I'm going in a quick fire just today. Oh, hands on deck, of course! Stove's reactor core is leaking, of course it is. Overdrive! Yes, we can! Um, okay, go there, Serpente, don't really need that, and let's go there for now and see what we can find there. Punch it! Rainy! That's a different way. Rousing speed! Your captain is awesome, she inspires everyone to else draw a card! Good! Thankful! Very thankful for that. Hey, another Earth Black Planet! Yay! Pep talk! Punch it! We're doing great! And guess what this is going to be? It's going to be horrible. Sir Penalty, the captain runs into an old flight, but he knows where to find a blueprint for where your rare ingredient. Chocolate powder! Yay! The floor is lava. Of, co of course, we find the, the chocolate in a planet which we cannot enter because the floor is lava. Makes sense. Makes perfect sense. Let's punch it further. We need to backtrack either way to actually get there quickly, so... And of course it's the terrifying monster. I can't... I, I have stuff to spend. No, no, you're, you're gonna damage us. Sorry, but I want to see if I can buy some good cards today. Or well, right now, actually, rather. Refined silk. We don't really need those two as much, so I'll take cheaper items to see if we can get some shit out of that. Next turn, we'll be able to buy a power glove now, which is something that is really useful for the captain, because you could use some more cards now and then. Chef's turn! Crisis of the deep end. The depressed diplomabot is tired of talk and is wrecking havoc in the lab. A scientist and captain of 12 turns. <laughs> of course, the thing designed to keep the crises from happening is actually the thing that is wrecking a crisis. Makes perfect sense. I'm going to do the all hands one because that one takes a lot more damage if we actually get it to happen. Not really any use to do this free sample right now, but let's see if there's anything we could take. Let's take the Vexel and destroy that as soon as we can. Taste test, please say there's a... I wished for the Gamma Ray Bone Analyzer. Maybe the Call of Duty could do that. Destroy the flux inverter, otherwise the discard pile is going to be empty. Sorry, that's going to be horrible. 
Thank you. Now we will be. A Wait a second, what did I do? And now we'll be able to get a card here that we can destroy the Vexel with. A flambe, to be exact. And now we can destroy that Vexel here. Bit of a complicated way to destroy a Vexel that cost a lot of money and power, but. It did its job! An Ixar Brunalizer we could probably use to get rid of something else, but there's nothing to get rid of! Yay! Next turn. We could probably use another egg, it's better to deploy. Let's use a deployable because we still have Chrysai going on everywhere. Crisis is going on everywhere. Why do you say Chrysai? It's not like cacti. It's like Chrysis and not cacti. My brain just going like, oh yeah! It's gonna handle an eye! It's gonna be a Chrysai! No, no, my, my brain just definitely derped there for, very badly. Let's see what we can do here. Breakthrough! That's always good. Let's see, who needs cards? You need cards, and you... That could be nice as well. Hmm. Captain, you are gonna hit some breakthrough. And then... Foresight. Play with one power. Nothing too interesting, actually. Nothing too interesting. Uh, let's see what they could and get here. Yes, I do want that free sample really badly as well, but nothing we can do in this turn. Let's give you an Aegis battery so you can repair some shit when you're on it anyway. I don't know why I just started talking like that. But yeah, it's, it's a thing. Engineer's turn, the last turn for today. Doors busted, of course. We need to really repair the doors now because otherwise we're gonna be shit. Yeah, you draw a card. Leftovers. Of course it's leftovers. Let's repair a door and two of the shields. Otherwise our door might cause us to damage shit. And let's exterminate some vexels. Nice! Nice and easy, quick and peasy. That's, that's not a thing. That is definitely not a thing. Gotta get some post cheddar cheese to get the worth up. Vit on average. That's nice. Uh, not really that nice, but still. Yeah, it's it's fine. It's it's fine, okay? It's fine. An asteroid, of course. Of course. Well, I guess that was it for today. I hope you guys all enjoyed this episode. I feel like it went really well this time. Nothing too interesting, but we did find the Chocolium powder on the map, meaning we'll be able to get to it in the next episode, most likely. So, I hope I will see you guys in that next episode in about three or four days, I'm pretty sure it is. It's not going to be every day anymore because I'm doing some series at the same time, like I have two episodes of one series in a week and then two of the other. Uh, currently Tomb Raider and Space Food Truck as we're playing now, and then we have Rocket League once a week. Machinki! If you don't know the game, that's like a open TTD style game will be coming very soon as well. And I still have a slot free, which I don't have a game for yet. So if you have any suggestions for any games I could play on the channel, do comment down below. And I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode, and I will see you guys next time. Bye bye!